tis the season to give. On the flip side, some want to take. That's always the case, mm -hmm. right? So the Better Business Bureau tried to offer up some advice on this while having a little holiday fun. They came up with the 12 scams of Christmas, highlighting the most common scams that pop up during the holiday yeah. season. Alyssa looked into this. She's going to walk us through them this morning. This is a neat way for us to kind of remember what these scams are. Yes, we all know the song, right? Mm -hmm. On the <laughs> first day of Christmas, yes, my yes, true love is to me, right? Well, let's start backwards since that's going to save us some time and no... I am not going to annoy you with my singing this morning. <laughs> so, on the 12th day of Christmas, the scammers gave to me a little pop up here counterfeit goods, look alike website, fake shipping notifications, malicious e cards, fake Santa letters, fake emergencies, fake charities, temporary holiday jobs, faulty gift cards, fake dating profiles, puppy scams and free beauty product trials that just aren't free. So, Dustin, Julia, you got all that? You ready to sing it all backwards to me? How are you feeling about it? Well, I guess I do have a question. I'm kind of confused on the fake shipping notifications. I feel like I've known some of those scams, but that one I don't know that I've heard of. Yeah, so I was going to ask you guys, in all seriousness, I mean, this is a real problem. So to explain that a little bit further, there are mail carriers that will send you something that'll say, like, hey, your package didn't get delivered, click here. So you click there, you get this tracking number, you're thinking it's a tracking number, but it turns out to be not a tracking number. And actually, when you click, you're giving your personal information out, and that's how they get you. What about Malice eCards? I wasn't quite sure about that one. And this is pretty similar to the fake shipping notifications. You get an email for what looks like a friendly eCard. Mm -hmm. You click it to get it to open so you can see it. Turns out you just click the link that gives access to your personal information and malware even. So okay. a thing to remember too, they say, when in doubt, delete it out. Oh, so much to remember. So there many is, Grinches out there. I know. <laughs> this time of year is no special. Kidding. Oh. All right, thanks for walking us through it and not making us sing. Yeah, exactly.